The small addition to the collection of utilities in MS0P is intended to show how easy it is to use several capabilities of MQ service object definitions, publish subscribe, and administration APIs. PubQStat is a very simple Java program that uses the PCF classes to find how many messages have passed through a queue and then publishes that to any interested parties who have subscribed to the topic. The data is published in an XML format to make it easier to parse instead of the binary PCF format. The program uses the reset QStats command. One of the problems with this command is that only a single program can use it as a time because the counters are reset after each invocation. Publishing the data is a way of making the information available to multiple consumers. If you use this program, then make sure that any other programs that use reset queue stats are disabled. For example, one of the other components of MS0P is an activity viewer that runs inside the Explorer to graphically show traffic. It also uses reset queue stats operations, so can't be used at the same time as this program. Other programs that might use reset queue stats include system management products, such as Tivoli and Megamon. Command line options are available to specify the topic for the publication and to specify the queues to monitor, either explicitly or read from a file. Wildcards are also available so you can monitor all queues. The interval between data collection is also specified here. PubQStat is designed to be run as an MQ service, started with the queue manager and stopped when you end the queue manager. The service object definitions on a queue manager have variables that get filled in, for example with a queue manager name and the installation directory. Though of course you don't have to use these service definitions if you prefer to start applications in a different way. For this example I've manually created a subscription that directs publications to the ms0p.sub queue. Other applications can create their own subscriptions or have an administered subscription so they just need to do mqget on the destination queue. Because it's PubSub, the publisher needs no changes to get the same data to additional consumers. Now we can look at the messages on that queue. I'm going to use another MSRP plugin, the Message Manager, to look at the messages. And here we can see the topic and the data within the message. Each queue is listed with information about the messages put and got. In real life, all you then need is an application to get the messages, parse them and do something with the data. And that's another demonstration of how easy it can be to work with MQ.